What is going on guys, it is Brad or Demon Asylum here. I'm bringing you all a new Fallout 4 video. I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can get all of your special stats maxed out to 10 using the duplication glitch that came out about a day or two ago. Uh, this glitch with the special stats has been known about for basically all of that time as well, but I did not put a video out about it yet because I was working on literally like three or four other glitches that basically nobody knows about, and those will be coming out over the course of this coming week. Also guys, if you don't already know, I am doing a giveaway for two copies of Fallout 4. If you're interested in that whatsoever, go ahead and click on the giveaway video link in the description below. And now let's get started with the video. So first of all, if you're not familiar with the duplication glitch, I'll have a link for that in the description, but I'll give you guys a brief explanation of it right here. Basically what you need to do is have your dog as a companion and you're going to drop an item on the ground that you want to duplicate and you're going to want to have your dog go ahead and pick up the item by clicking on him and then clicking on the item and as soon as your dog moves his head down to pick up the item or even maybe like a second before that you're going to want to pick up the item as well if you time it correctly which it can take a little bit of practice to get the timing down you will pick up the item basically at the same time as your dog picks up the item and then not only will you have that item go back to your inventory but your dog will also drop the item as well so then you will have two you're going to use that duplication glitch on the special book that you find inside your house after you escape from vault 111 it is in your son's room you see it in the beginning of the game on a dresser i believe and then it is on the floor in your son's room after you escape vault 111 and you go back to your house you're going to want to pick that book up and when you do the first time it basically lets you put one stat into any of your specials uh, such as strength endurance perception etc again and so this glitch is going to allow you to get infinite amounts of those special books so that you can max all of your special stats. I believe there's seven of them. Correct me if I'm wrong. You're gonna be able to max all of those out to 10 right away. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is obviously the duplication glitch. I'm gonna to explain to you guys the way that I'm doing it in this video because I literally don't mess up a single time in this gameplay, I don't think. Um, so basically what I do is go to a very flat area. I personally went throughout Sanctuary and I scrapped a bunch of the, the big broken down houses because under them left really, really big flat platforms. I go onto one of those platforms, as you can see in the gameplay here. I basically drop the book close to the edge. I have my dog go in front of the book a little bit away, and then I back up and I have him come grab the book. You will notice consistently if you do it like this, that your dog will take a few steps, and then before he picks up the book, he will stop. He will just stop and stand there. And then like a second later, he will pick up the book. So when your dog comes walking towards the book, as soon as he stops, you're gonna wait a second and then pick up the book. And if you get the timing down, you will literally have this basically every single time. When I first started to do this, it maybe took me five to 10 tries to get the timing down. And then after that, I went off basically on the streak that you guys are seeing in this gameplay video of not messing up whatsoever. So again, guys, you're just taking advantage of the duplication glitch that I posted a video of yesterday. Again, the link to that will be in the description below and an annotation on the screen probably if you want a better, more detailed description of the duplication glitch and how to do it. That video will tell you and then you can carry over that method to using it for the special book as I have shown in this video. It really isn't that hard as I explained though. If you do it the way that I'm doing it in the video and that I explained, it's only going to take a few tries to get used to it and then I guarantee you guys will have it down in no time. It really is very simple and it seems to be a lot easier than it is with other items such as guns and such. But using this method honestly makes it so much easier for basically any item that you want to duplicate. Anyway, guys, that is going to be about it for this video. I do hope you all have enjoyed or found it helpful. If so, feel free to drop a like on it down below and subscribe for many more Fallout 4 videos to come. Thanks for watching, everyone, and peace out.